what not to use in brushes. These are brushes, and you can even see some of the hairs, Stephanie, that I've taken these away from clients, guests of ours. I've seen them take, after we've done their hair, they begin to take out of their purse, or I spot it in their purse, and I see these wicked, terrible tools that want to abuse beautiful hair. If you want beautiful hair, you've got to use the right brush. Let me tell you what not to use, because that's sometimes the beginning of education. This was used in the Roman gladiator's time. You whack somebody with this, you put holes in their skin. It is plastic, it is brittle, it has a, a metal backing that makes it even hotter. Now they'll tell you that it's got holes and it ventilates, but those little teeth rip. And if I used this on Stephanie's fine hair, I would break continually her hair. Oh yeah, it'll get it straight, but it'll also get it really tangled. How many of you have watched your hair get tangled in one of these and not be able to get it out? That is a nightmare. Then, when you get these kind of little brushes, all those little beads, because they're generally not a professional brush, those beads that are protecting it from your scalp and helping it go through the hair, the bead breaks off. And now it's scratching your hair. Hair is like your skin. You look at 70 skin, it's beautiful skin. Well, the hair is the same. You scrape hair when you don't even know you're doing it and you're getting drier and drier and you begin to lose that shine and that bounce. Oh yeah, it's doing what you want to do. But this is even worse getting caught in your hair. Then these little brushes that they call boar bristle, it is so funny. I can't believe they get away with calling this boar bristle, but it's just a bunch of plastic. You pay for the boar bristle, but when it gets caught in there, it becomes again a nightmare to the hair, to you. Quick story, real story. Girl getting ready for her wedding. She's doing her hair and of course she's nervous and she's in a hurry. No one had talked her not to do these things and she got it caught up and we get a phone call at the salon. Crying bride, can you get this out of my hair? Understand, the wrong brush is the wrong brush. We have a series of brushes that we've been doing a series of training and education on. The right real boar bristle for the right hair. The right beads that are actually one solid piece not a beaded coating edge of a piece of plastic that'll fall out. And again, we talked to you about the right paddle brush. The right brush used in the right hands with the right training is like us behind the scenes as salon stylists are able to make your hair look great. And you say when you leave, I wish my hair looked like you made it look, Jeff. The reality is keep watching and be tuned into our Jeffrey Paul blog and find out more about how the beauty tips can give you the ability to look yourself and look beautiful in here.